you want to change the Howdy item in your toolbar and remove the Howdy text or customize the text of this item, now you can with Toolbar Extras. Hi, my name is David Decker from Decker Web and I want to show you a new awesome feature of my Toolbar Extras plugin. It is new in version 1.4.0 and let's jump right into it. Here, are, here we are in my demo install, a local install, and we want to change this howdy item, this welcome item or however you call it. So toolbar extras, my plugin is already activated here. Let's jump into the settings. These are located here. Uh, the sub menus, or you can go with WordPress general settings and here toolbar extras, smart tweaks, and here change the welcome item. This is what we want. It is set to no by default because we don't touch that by default, but you can change it now. So now let's first replace the word. Uh, we change it to welcome and so it then will be welcome David Decker because David Decker is my display name here. So let's change it. So it's now welcome but we don't like it. We want to say we want to say hi. So let's say hi. Okay, this looks fine. Also on the front end, this looks nice. Okay, but uh, now we want to change the full text. So let's change this here. And here's the great thing. We can use shortcodes now. The plugin toolbar extras now has a few shortcodes and these are for the dynamic values of uh, user data. You can use your ID. This is one currently. You can even use your email, maybe you want that. Your login name, this is your login handle. The display name, that's currently David Decker. The first name only or the last name only. It's, it's all logical as you see. So this was preset because I tested it before. So let's uh, save it and now we have this greeting here. So let's change it to, uh, to login. So we place here the login. Okay. So let's save it. Takes a little time. So now it's my login name. And uh, but I don't want it. I just want to go with first name. It is better. Have a great, awesome. So this is perfectly awesome. Let's save the stuff. And this is absolutely cool. Now I can use whatever I want here. Perfectly fine. So now let's change the URL. Let's remove this. When I don't touch the URL, it will just um, it will just go to my profile page like it, it does always. This is the WordPress default. So let's get back to the settings and now we want to change this maybe to an external URL. Just use Google maybe for whatever reason. So, and let's open it in a new tab, in a new browser tab. So let's change on the front end. So now I'm on the front end and I click on my item and I land on Google. Perfectly fine. So now let's change it to a, a 
internal URL. Let's just use this one here. This URL of this settings tab. I just copy the URL bar from my browser and place this here. And I don't want new tab, I want I want this in the same browser tab. So let's go on the front end. So and when I click now here, I just land on my settings tab. It could be any valid URL from your installation, from another installation, an external website, whatever. It just has to be the full URL with the HTTP um, and the slashes and the stuff. Here you can also test the URL from here. So it's really easy, it's really logical, really easy to use and finally you can change this item. So if you want to use my plugin, go to toolbarextras.com. Here you find a few more info. Just make sure you subscribe to my newsletter, join the site builder community, donate for my plugin and don't forget give a 5 star rating and of course subscribe and like my YouTube channel, give a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, see you next time.